Hello class. So we will review the, um, today we will review the F major scales, uh, which we have learned it last Monday. And also we will start playing arpeggio on F. So let's review the F major scale with correct fingerings. So F major has a slightly different fingerings than uh, all the other uh, white key major we have played. Um, it has four fingers. One, two, sorry. So for the right hand, it has a different fingerings. One. with the fourth finger at the end. changes, uh, which ends with the fourth finger. So let's combine together with both hands. It might be a little tricky, but I think you can uh, fully do it. major scales, both hands together. Now let's go over the arpeggio on the F. Arpeggio on F um, is basically broken chords with expanded position, right? So we have F major chord, which is F, A, and C. That's our triad, F major triad. And Arpeggio is a broken chord expanding to the next F. So our fingering is basically the same as you played on any other white key major. That was one octave arpeggio. And let's expand it to two octaves. Same fingering. Same thing. It, uh, our arpeggio on F has the same fingerings as as other um, major key arpeggio. Today, let's look over the Chiapanecas, the Mexican hand clapping song again, um, on page 120 and 121. So here we have staccatos, new articulations, and then we have um, accent, marcato that you play with emphasis. The 
and we played hands separately for for, for today's assignment. Um, for Monday's assignment, I want you to play, I want you to combine both hands together when you feel comfortable uh, hands alone. So, and make sure that your staccatos are short and much more crispy, that it differentiates from a regular note. So when you play the regular note, that will be note without the staccatos. So with the staccatos will be and then marcato. Emphasis with D and C. Again. Both hands are staccato. And then you go back from the first bracket, you repeat from the beginning. You move, you skip the first bracket, you move on to the second bracket. Second page, we have variations on the left hand. They are the same broken chords from this chord progression F major chord, B flat major chord, F chord, and C7. But we have a broken, yeah, we have a bass. And then interval, interval, bass, interval, interval. Articulations at the same time. Staccatos, staccatos with marcato accent, and then we have dynamic that comes that grows from the soft to loud. So we'll play what with much more emphasis, also with short, crispy notes. And then we have a repeating sound, which means before, not all the way to the front, but where you see that repeating dot, so the top of the second page. straight to the last line, bracket number two. So this will be your assignment, combining both hands together. And keep in mind all the new articulations that we learned from Monday. Staccato, accent, and then also repeating sign with the brackets. Going back to the front. And when you play the second time, you skip to second bracket. Watch out for the different dynamics. F forte, meta forte, this accent. And then here we have a bunch of the different articulations all at once. And the second time you go back to the beginning, I mean, to the beginning of the page, uh, top of the page. Second time, you skip the first bracket and move on to the second. Key is to play slowly 
maybe much more under tempo uh, for it to, when, you, when you're combining both hands together. So it's set moderately fast, but you are allowed to play in a steadier, much more comfortable tempo, well, whichever tempo you, you have. Even slower. <laughs> 